per lo Yemen è per la prima volta rappresentato qui eh, come, come paese alla Biennale Architettura 2016. Si è voluto fortemente che questa iniziativa avesse luogo proprio per richiamare l'attenzione internazionale su quanto sta accadendo allo Yemen. L'architettura dello Yemen purtroppo è messa in pericolo perché eh, da più di un anno si stanno effettuando dei, dei bombardamenti. Bombardamenti che hanno distrutto molti siti, tra i quali una cinquantina di siti archeologici importanti eh, o di tipo storico. During the time I was working in Yemen and afterwards I was not pleased by the negative stereotype of Yemen presented in the international media through their unilateral news coverage. So I was looking for an opportunity to present Yemen in a positive way on the world stage. In order to arrive here uh, we established a beautiful Yemen team. It is consisted of several Yemeni members. They managed to get the cooperation of the Ministry of Culture uh, in Yemen. In the end the Yemen Pavilion is a tribute to Yemen and to their population and to preserve an appeal to the national and the international community to preserve beautiful Yemen because we don't want to have the fascinating and ingenious architecture of Yemen lost for humanity. For the outfitting of the Yemeni pavilion, we choose a simple and modest wooden installation which recalls uh, the basic shapes of architecture, which are the circle and the square. And we are having uh, panels with photos and text to describe the vernacular architecture of Yemen, which is a century-long tradition of building with natural elements integrating the architecture with the environment. We also have been decorated uh, panels with uh, motifs of uh, Islamic art of the Al Ashrafia Mosque in Taiz, which is a very uh, pretty example of a vernacular uh, Yemeni art. And we are also showing two videos recalling uh, the uh, work of the craftsman, the one who in the, in the centuries could preserve the Yemeni building techniques. <laughs> 